Between Forms, The Nature of Painting and Photography, March 14 through April 25, 2015. A group show featuring four artists, two photographers and two painters, and mixed media. This show basically talks about interjecting latent offerings which triumph and shift our understanding of the nature of painting and photography today. We're going to start with Jonathan Apgar's layered responses to the process of painting, weave pictorial strategies, presenting figures and landscapes in flux as indeterminate dialogues. Apgar's have an MFA painting and drawing from UCLA and a bachelor's in fine art from California State University. His work has been shown in exhibitions at the Torrance Art Museum, George Lawson Gallery, Shoshana Wayne, Acme, and many more. He is on loan to us. Thank you, Acme Gallery. Apgar is a recipient of the 2012 Hoyt Scholarship, the 2011 Resnick Scholarship, the 2011 Booth Art Scholarship. This is a very large painting. We're going to walk in for a bit of a detail right now. This painting is 72 inch tall by 60 inch wide, oil on canvas. Donnell Williams. Donnell is a bachelor's in art, in fine art at UCLA, and will be graduating in a few months. His textural paintings reflect cross-media gestures in an era of image manipulation and monumentality. Williams has been selected by Helen Molesworth, Connie Butler, and Aaron Mushayeti in the successive, successive yearly undergraduate juried exhibition at UCLA. He also has been featured in Pulling Teeth at New White Gallery and the Undergraduate Scholarship Award Exhibition, UCLA. Influenced by re the relationship with his father, Donnell Williams's paintings correspond to his personal experience of his father's illness in his final years. Williams' practice of mixed media paintings with usage of same materials that his father, Mr. Williams, used as a hard-working laborer. Steel, cement, and wood is an approach to overcome such trauma and rejuvenate his father's memories. A quote from Donnell, I attempt to reconstruct these personal moments of psychological escape and comfort, which oftentimes happen to coincide with watching my father sleep peacefully. This is written by Bashak Comert, who is on the Sans Alexander Gallery. It's very interesting. I would like to have a close-up of it. This is a very large painting. They're both large paintings. And this has incredible texture. Cement and wire mesh and oil, aluminum tile adhesive on wood panel. So if you see the texture very up close, you will see all of this is actual mesh. And if you walk back and forth of it, you can see it kind of glares back and forth at you and brings a very extreme three-dimensional aspect to it. Holland Patrick Smith. And these two photos from the series called Suit and Salt. So again, this idea behind these images are the working, the working people of the world. And again, it's 2015, brand new work, archival inkjet prints. Editions of three, they're 20 inches by 24 inches each. And Colin Patrick Smith holds his MFA from Yale University. And he's been in many shows. We're very proud to have him in this, this show. This is Donnell Williams. It's a large piece, oil, aluminum on canvas, 82 inches by 82 inches. We're now going to walk up very close to it so that you have a sense of the detail. The white lines are mesh and aluminum that are transfixed onto the painting. This is a piece, again, by Donnell Williams, a large oil on canvas. This is a piece by Carrie Yuri. She is in the collection of museums such as LACMA, Los Angeles County Museum of Art, as well as had shows there. And so this is an edition of six. It is pigment prints on aluminum or pigment prints on paper, on central paper. This is the work of Carrie Yuri Photography. This is a Jonathan Apgar piece again. It's quite a large piece and it's an oil painting on canvas. 84 inches by 60 inches. That is Jonathan Apgar. Now we go to another and third final piece. This is Jonathan Apgar again. 
a very large oil painting on canvas. This is the third piece by Kerry Yuri. It is a diptych and it is mounted on aluminum. It is an edition of three. And again, this is the artist whose work is in the collections of museums such as LACMA. It's 36 inches by 36 inches each. The last piece of the tour, this is the beautiful dunes by the artist Colin Patrick Smith, who holds his MFA from Yale. And this is the real color of the dunes and the real color of the sky. It's just such an exquisite piece. Very small edition as well. We hope you have enjoyed this show at Sans Alexander Gallery and we look forward to seeing you for the next one.